Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm sharing five chic and easy looks that you can wear on repeat throughout March. Um, some of them are copy and paste or just change them to fit your kind of favourite silhouettes. So first up is obviously a white on white because you know I love it year round but best to be worn in spring and summer. Um, Zara Denim, which I love, they're kind of a low rise, my favourite, um, kind of baggy boyfriend fit. Um, love them, brandy, long sleeve, kind of tank top that I'm wearing with it. Um, that The blazer that I wear all the time from Dunst, it's so good, but any kind of like, I feel like the accessories are really just warming this look up, um, like for the time of year, and I love that. Um, so yeah, the bag is sod, blazer is done, boots are old mango, pretty sure, yeah they are mango, um, but any kind of western suede boot, I mean you could do any blazer, um, you don't have to do a check, but I just love this silhouette in general, with like the tank, the denim, the pointed toe boots and like a blazer, um, but yeah, the, yeah that's the boots there. Um, I love them, but also don't have to do sweat. I just like that because I think that like it kind of adds different, I don't know, maybe like depth. I just love them and I like to wear that. Um, but it's super easy, chic, all the vibes that you love. So look number two is probably one of my favorite easy, chic, effortless silhouettes, especially at this time of year when I can bring out my linens that have been stuck in my wardrobe since probably September. Um, I love these linen trousers. I'm pretty sure they're a weekday, maybe Arquette. Um, you know how H&M now, you can buy the different brands online, but I will try and link them or a very similar pair. Yeah, so I love them. Um, I'm just pairing it with a cashmere cardi from me and m and just my ballet flats and i'm going to see a tea and usual tote bag um but to be honest i would sometimes just pop this on with trainers um and a cap here like i'm wearing and this is like a weekend look it's easy it's chic you can also wear it to work if you dress it up the right way depending on what works for you but just that um knit or even just like a white tee and then the knit over the shoulders is nice Whatever works for you, this kind of silhouette is perfect for the new season. Look number three is blue shirt. Pretty sure this is an old men's shirt because um, it is super big on me. And blue denim, like a light blue denim. I love this. I love it with the knit around my shoulders. Like kind of, you're still, it's not, it is like spring, but you can still have that layer, like extra layer. You could even add again on top, depending on where you live, whatever suits. Um, but yeah, I love this silhouette. If you have followed me, if you know me, you will know this is like one of my go-tos. I love to wear it with white denim as well, add a belt in, whatever, you can change it up. But the core silhouette of just the oversized shirt, baggy denim, and then like the knit around the shoulders, I've added these zara um like ballet flats and they've got like i've showed them before you can kind of see they're fun they're easy they're just kind of giving this look a bit of an edge to be honest because just to make it more interesting visually um and yeah I've just my ll bean tote bag i always bring with me but again you can dress up or down so for look number four this is like a a silhouette that i wear year round and I just kind of swap it out per the seasons. So what colors that I wear and whether I wear like a tank like I am here or like a t-shirt or a long sleeve, it just depends. So for March, I'm sticking with the kind of black blazer to not be too summery, um, but the light colored slouchy trousers and then like light trainers and a tank. Um, again, if it is colder, you can still throw a coat or a trench or something over this. Um, but I just feel like showing that little bit of skin at the top just makes it slightly more spring vibes. And obviously with the lighter coloured trousers. These are from Abercrombie and I got them 
like last March, I think, uh -huh, um, when they opened their store in Edinburgh and I love them, such great trousers. Um, and I'm just showing you here how I would wear it. So if I was like going out for dinner and I wanted to just throw on like a cute bag um, and it will kind of like balance with the trainers. Um, so it's not, it's like not too fancy, still casual. Um, but if it's just like day to day, then my usual LLB bag that we love, um, the Hyronic Bone Tote. Um, so yeah, that is like just an everyday look and again, so easy to change up and fit what works for you. And the final look is again, those linen slouchy trousers um, in the cream and I've just paired it with this Cezanne knit, which I think bringing in, I don't wear lots of colour, but I do love blue and this is like, I think it's actually called sea moss, so it's kind of like a greeny blue. Um, but I think for this time of year, bringing in something like, just like a pop, even if it is muted like this, or just like a muted blue or like a muted green, I just think it just adds something, it elevates, it's nice to wear with the lighter colours rather than just wearing all neutrals. Um, so yeah, I love this look. I wear this, I literally wore it the other day and it was colder later so I like pulled a coat on again but it's still like it's giving me hope it's giving me spring it's what I need but yeah I just think it's super chic effortless an easy silhouette it's easy to copy and paste and to put your own spin on it and usually will be pieces that you will have in in your wardrobe um, most of us will have like a nice knit and okay if you want to invest in one that is slightly more colourful um, you can do that um, but you will also have it for a long time and the Cezanne one specifically this Emile um, cardigan it's great um, I've just added something to it I wear the same things all the time and I popped this on the other day and I thought I would film it and show you um, just with the Ralph Lauren um, shirt under and that's my details. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.